We're going to Nigeria as so a park with me. Let's go to Nigeria. Basically, I have all my things layer here, right? I don't even know what I'm taking yet because I decided late yesterday that I was going to go today. I've been like thinking about it for a while. I don't think I'll be able to make it back home December because I'll be here December. So I'm like, you know what? Let me see if I can uh, make it in. Am I in frame? Let me see if I can make it in November so I wouldn't have to like go home December. Also, a friend of mine lost the mom and the burial is this weekend, Friday 8th of November. And Joy also lost someone. That burial is 9 of November, which is Saturday. So I'm like, you know what? Let me just use it as an opportunity to like be there for both of them and also uh, visit home for like a week or two, 10 days, two weeks maximum. So I can come back to Ghana. And if I can't make it back home for Christmas, I won't feel too guilty about it because Usually, I used to celebrate one Christmas in Ghana, one Christmas in Nigeria, but now because of my business, I don't even think I can travel during the festivities home again. So this time around, I'm going to take you home. You know, usually when I go to Nigeria, I'm mostly in Lagos and I vlog Lagos, but this time I'm going home to Delta. Not just worry, I'm going to my hometown. So. I've decided to, you know, take you guys along. This uh, luggage is brand new. I got it yesterday in Makola. When I went to Makola to buy things for the shop, I just saw this luggage. It was really cute. I think it was one of the things that motivated me to say, pack and go. I'm basically just uh, picking clothes. I don't know what and what I'm taking, but so far, I have three trousers there. For this, this has four. Then I have shorts, two shorts in it. Really, if if if, if that's not enough clothes, I'll just wear my sister's clothes or joy. Anybody? I'm taking my washing shirt. You know what I was planning to do? I was basically planning to get some uh, Ghana food and uh, that soup. Stuff, just like I can make and uh, I can introduce my family to some of the Ghana delicacies that I love. I might get on my way now because I'm going to the shop and uh, my flight is for evening, so I'm going to the shop. I'll stay there till 4 4 30 and then I'll leave. So I'm going to try to get that soup spice. Right, so I can I can make something. Maybe I might get I might get a peanut paste because how you put do your own peanut paste in Ghana is different from the one in Nigeria. So if it's going to be Ghanaian peanut soup. Might as well make it the way Ghanaians they make it. But really, I think that was, that's was enough clothes. As a matter of fact, that might be too much clothes. It's better too much than not enough. This I'm going to leave it behind. It's too much clothes here. This is a um, if you want Ghana like that food festival, I got this material there. So I'm going to take it home and try and make something. I'm to basically 
It's just gonna be here. Stay back. trying to screen some stuff at I think that's enough oh. yep This one's four. Toner, hyaluronic acid, ordinary. Urban skin RS face wash. Vitamin C serum and toothpaste. Straight smash. If you ask me, this is going to be. This is a hair conditioner, face hair, moisturizer, please don't. Go to, go to be glue. Sense I'm taking the one I'm sweating. <laughs> oh my goodness! I'm basically running around because I've been cleaning. If I if I uh, if I want to travel, I clean. I'm almost out of work. Let me 
Victoria's Secret Bear Vanilla and Midnight Blue. Club the Nude. This I got in a caramel. This is so nice. Let me wait today. There's this coupon in a caramel that means different scent for you. Oh, this, this smells so nice. Each time I wear this, I get so many compliments. I think it was less than 500 CDs, which means it's one of my cheapest perfume. But it's one of my most complimented scents ever. Just going to take this sunscreen. Let's try body serum. Serum. This is a spraying can for this hair I'm wearing. This hair only requires water. See me that I was saying, I'm not taking too much stuff. See the way this bag is not full. Oh, and I need, I need extra bag. Let me pack my handbag quickly. Gonna be a carry on. The camera is going to go here. I don't even think I will need the microphone. So just just in case because most times I always forget to vlog but even if I forget I'll continue when I get to Lagos <laughs> Oh, I'm going to put flip flop and I'll take this bag instead. So here. This is Joy's dress. She forgot <coughs> she forgot the last time she came. So I'm going to I'm going to bring it for her. Oh. Let me see if it will work first. Nope. 
No, I have to figure it out. Be back. Hey, Victory. So I've been able to figure it out. I legit have to get rid of some stuff. Extra hair. A jacket. I basically just took. I'm just realizing that this bag. It don't take much stuff at all, and it looks big. This was thousand eight. I should have just stuck in my order. Anyway, I'm done. I'm just going to clean uh, this place up. Just put the things that I took out back inside the room. Just for my classy get here, and then I'm going to. I'll see you when I get to the shop. Hey Kony Badje, welcome to Lagos. You know I said that when I got to the shop, I was going to vlog all of that, but I was running late and I was I needed to do my nails, do inventory at the shop, settle a lot of things before you know I legit almost you know uh, missed my flight, so I just ran. But now I'm in Lagos, Nigeria, so welcome to Lagos, Nigeria. It's going to be a fun couple of days here before we leave here back to Delta. So yeah, if you're here, you're watching, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let's go explore Lagos. I hooked up with my friends already and we're hitting the streets of Lagos. Somehow the radio was playing the most perfect song for someone who's been away coming home. Like not if it's bad. I absolutely, absolutely love me. With this city, I have a love and hate relationship. So yeah. This time I'm actually going to have like an active, you know, stay in Lagos. I'm going to take it to Lagos Island. We're going, it's going to be a lot of things. So I'm really excited so for the next couple you. of days, and then we'll go to Delta so also we'll vlog. It's going to be fun. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let's go. Me, see, I just want to go fresh. You know, I need to come. Yeah, now that's the place. Now I go go lost my phone. I like that place. Like where they inside. Uh, uh, If you lose God, <laughs> take his. Now that one, I don't care when I cry, not be sunburn. I'm going to cry. I don't care when I cry, I cry for them. There's a bongo police station. No, they, they say, they say they're okay. They know they are listening. The camera around the walk. I say why? How come I know they walk inside and stuff? Yeah, yeah. This is the camera around the walk. I say what? There's a bongo police station. So no, I, they are trying to the police phone. Come now. No, you don't get no, from my iPhone. That no be iPhone. Oh, okay. Yeah, iPhone or Samsung. Even you know, like, I guess Samsung where you get the tablet, say the iPhone lost. Mm. Like Samsung. Because easy to track iPhone and to track Samsung. Yeah. So I'm in my hotel room. I'm in Lagos. I think you saw when I arrived already, and I was just vibing to the streets of Lagos. So I'm um, freshly showered in my hotel room, and you know what that means? It's time to order food. <laughs> my hair is a mess. That's what I'm wearing. So you know it. One thing I do when I come to Lagos is order all the food that I've been missing, and the place, the place, and Chicken Republic. I will always want to buy from this place because I really don't like hotel food. I think like hotel food are overly too pricey and they don't even taste good. So see what I got? I got a um, smoky hot Nigerian jollof. Yes, a plate of Nigerian jollof and chicken. 
I'm excited. Then I got a little uh, Nigerian fried rice also and chicken. That's one thing I always do when I come to Lagos, right? Nearly I get in, I just order everything I want to eat. So I was hungry as I ordered this food. Then these snacks, these are what I need. And I just wanted to get my hand. Ooh, this is a big. I don't know how I'm going to eat all of this. I'm basically just spraying it out on top of the over in my on top of the bed. So bear with me, I got hot dog. This is so good. I cannot wait to dig in. Right. I got sugar donuts. Quite huge. Another donut. And uh, I'm really excited to be back to drinking 50 cl coke again. I'm used to drinking 33 cl in Ghana. It's not enough. I need something as big as this. This is welcome to Nigeria. Welcome to Nigeria. This is what welcome to Nigeria. 50 cl coke. You drink one and you'll be satisfied. Anyway, let's eat. I'm really excited to be to be in Lagos. So when I go to the shop in the afternoon, I forgot to vlog. I'm going to start with the jello fries because what is what is first this thing. Anyway, so I'm here now. I arrive in about 10, 3 p.m. to 2 30 to uh, 3 p.m. each. I got uh, to get hotel in Ikeja. It's very it's very um, tricky. There are lots of hotels in Kaja, but because it's um, close to the airport, they, they, are, they are always almost completely booked. Well, I find the place short to them. And really, it's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. Oh, I'm sorry. Have water. I'm trying to. Well, see, when I come to Lagos, I like to shop. But I get things cheap. So I'm shopping basically. They're just replying me now. Oh, good old Nigerian jollof. This is amazing. Now let's try this. I will always get oh this food is nice. That a lot of is nice. If you're not sure where to get food, if you come to Lagos and Ikeja has this, the place that's born global, you'll find them. This is a pepper um, fried rice and pepper chicken. Mm, not too bad. But I think I prefer the jello because I'm in jello here anyway. So everything I order, both rice, jello rice, chicken, fried rice, chicken, snacks, a hot dog, donut, and this coke. They cost seven thousand. I'm coming. Let me show you how much. So everything for plus delivery cost seven thousand seven hundred. That's seventy seven cities. This hotel. There are, there are other guests at those being loud, <laughs> and I think you can hear them. Anyway, everything cost seven thousand seven hundred. That's seventy seven. Then service charge of two hundred seventy seven cities plus seventy uh, two hundred seven uh, service charge. That's 7,900, which is 779 CD, which is basically almost 80 CD. So, what do you think? Is it cheap? Or is it expensive? 
this can comfortably feed two persons. And you still have to mask. Wait. Anyway, so I'll that and I got food. I'm going to eat. Then I'm going to edit because I actually travel my laptop this time around. I've not uh, been editing anywhere. Edit. So tomorrow morning I'm going to Balogun Market and I'm excited to take it. That's why I'm staying in Lagos for an extra day before going to Delta. I want to go to Balogun Market. I want to get some things that I'm taking to Ghana, basically, because I, I like shopping here. Then I want to get some personal items also. I got like uh, someone that, that will take me around the market tomorrow. That market is so big, it's so huge. My Balogu market, you're going to get to see all of that. So I'm going to take it to Balogu market tomorrow and then we'll catch an evening flight to Worry Data State and I'll be home. Anyway, I'm going to quickly go demolish this off camera and share back to you guys. Bye. Don't worry, the bed is not thin. Welcome to Nigeria. The next day, this is officially our first day in Lagos. We don't count day of arrival because day of arrival I was just chilling at the hotel, eating and doing everything. So this is the next day. I've gone to the bank earlier, two bank basically. I had to sort some bank issues. I, you know, each time in Nigeria, I always sort one or two bank issues. I update ATMs and the rest of that. And you know, we have this Easter ATM, so I'm done with bank. I'm going to Lagos Island Market with my friend and the sister today. I'm excited. We're going to do a lot of things. I'm going to show you the market. We're going to shop for personal items. It's going to be fun. But before then, I need to get some braiding hair because I can't come to Nigeria without braiding. So I'm buying this hair and taking it back home to Delta where I will braid my hair before I will go back to Ghana basically. But it's officially our first day. I'm excited. Let's go.
You guys, see this color of the long one? You know, fine. Wait, okay. I'm forgetting our back there. And the one with the color where you lose, Nana. Yes, it's fine. It's so fine. Try that gold color. Something was killing her. That was very fine. Now you know the. And when when she even showed me the blend, when they blend and finish, I see blend. It was fine. Yeah, I saw the picture. Yeah. It was fine. So, might try. I'm coming. Might set. Might set my camera.
this way if you are if you are recording someone will just know you are recording but if you let if you click this screen you start seeing it <laughs> so yeah we're we're in a church or not church or this is box going to to this thing right she lives in ghana also anyway <laughs> we're going to get out of here is it cut down for <laughs> why well, down for going to the market and I'll check my that out. See, I woke up with a soul. I need to look for sunglasses. I'm trying to cover my face with, with this thing I'm wearing. I don't know what happened. Later, I'll go and now we're to the market now. We're going to give you the whole market vlog and the first and two days in Lagos in one vlog. So keep tuned for that. I'm going to end this one here now. Thank you for traveling with me. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.